upon you, Lady Nocturne. Yeah. Queen of Murk, and Empress of Shadow. Hear my voice. Ah, Carlyle. I was wondering when I'd hear from you again. Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of this Adventures of Drunken of Kier in Skyrim and we are continuing our our quest in the Thief Guild and one of the things that we need to do here actually is um, this quest we need to meet you with Kalaya at the Standing Stone so we are going to to actually do this we need to go with Brinjorf Brinjorf there uh, that's the the place. Um, okay. Let's just uh, let's just go there. Let me go in in first person here. What is the? Um, uh, you, you are the one that I need to meet. Okay, everyone is going to go in in their own their own time. No problem at all. <laughs> Let's just go there and I guess these guys are going to follow. Okay, let me take note of the... I'm, I'm kind of used to different games right now. I'm, I'm forgetting my, my keys, the key riders in this game. Uh, it's... Um, all right, let's just keep an eye here, so we can do this in uh, like maybe 25 or 30 minutes. Let's just go walking, so we can kind of see a little bit how how this is all doing. The town. All right. Is it here? They say if a vampire so much as scratches you. I don't remember what's the where are the <laughs> This is the gate. Hey yeah. This is in the other side then. Okay. Let's just go. Kind of foggy today here in Skyrim. The weather is not the best as it can be. But anyways, it's kind of a of a good thing to see. Okay, so where are we? We need to maybe to hold this. There should be a kind of a of a road a road around here, right? Yeah, there we are. So the standing stone is going to be there. And magically, these guys are going to be. Yeah, let's take that. <laughs> going to be around here, waiting for me. Those three. Okay, I need to get up there. Where can I go? Maybe through here? Seems there's like a like a trail from this part. Yeah, it seems so. Ooh, look at this. Nightingale Hall discovered. So this is the hall of the Nightingales. Dimitri Orlov. Video has low quality, Thank like uh, has low bit rate. All right. Let me check that. Let me check that up. I'm going to put a mega pause here in the in the episode, guys. All right. So we arrived to be what it seems to be the Hall of the Nightingales. Look at that that stone and that symbol there. Let's just talk with Goliath here. I'm glad you're here. 
Of course. What's the significance of this place? This is the headquarters of the Nightingales, cut into the mountainside by the first of our kind. Mm. We've come to seek the edge we need to defeat Mercer Frey. Okay, what kind of an edge? If you'll follow me, I'll try to explain on the way. Alright. Um... I'm not going to ask anything to Goliath right now. Please. Yeah, let's go. So something moved here. Okay, the entrance. Hello, Ranger. Ethan, 007, how are you, man? It's good to have you back in the stream. Let's just go inside. Nightingale Hall, excellent. Let me know, Ethan, how are you seeing the stream, if you have some problems with the quality. Uh, I tried to... I took a little bit here. We have a, a, another viewer in, so in... this is Nightingale Hall. ...in YouTube. I heard about this Dimitri. place when I joined the game, Dimitro. but I never believed it existed. Yes. It exists beyond you. It helped avert attention from our true nature. Okay. What's wrong, Brynjolf? Brynjolf. You must hear your brow furrowing. Trying to understand why I'm here last. I'm no priest, and I'm certainly not religious. Why pick me? This isn't about religion, Brynjolf. It's business. Okay, so this is business. I really don't don't know much of the Nightingales. This is the first time I play the Thief skills. This is Nightingale Hall. You're the first of the uninitiated to set foot inside. Excellent. In century. If you'll both proceed to the armory to don your Nightingale armor, we can begin the oath. Time's wasting, and Mercer's still out there. Let's get this show on the road. Okay. And Ethan says, the same is good. Also, after you collect the key, you can keep it, instead of turning it in me at the Anaxas and unlimited lockpicks. This is enough to make your head spin, eh? That's excellent. Look at all this place. What are things here? Can you sleep in this one? No. Alright. The altar. Kind of an abandoned fort here. This All is right. enough to make your head spin, eh? Yeah. But it's not spinning in mine, at least. <laughs> Time's oh. wasted, and Mercer's still out there. Okay. Let's get this show on the road. Yes. You uh, hesitant to don your nightingale. <gasps> I think we should trust the lass and take the deal. Okay. Do I have that? So I can activate this. Equip the nightingale armor. That's what I need to do. Alright, let me see how how this goes. Apparel. What is this? Um here. So we should have I have a lot of things here. Uh, there we are. This one, this one, this one, and this one. And nothing else, right? Yeah, we're, we're pretty fine here. Look at, look at me! How tough I look with that. Hmm. I really like this... This thing. Let's just go. I think the Nightingale armor is the best looking armor. This is, this is amazing. Look at this. Okay, Lance, we've got these get-ups on. Now what? Beyond this gate is the first step in becoming a nightingale. Okay. Oh, there, Lass. I appreciate the armor, but becoming a nightingale, that was never discussed. To hold any hope of defeating Mercer, I want to be a nightingale. Me, here. <laughs> if she's to accept you as one of her own, an arrangement must be struck. All right. What sort of arrangement? I need to know the terms. Are quite simple, Brynjolf. Nocturnal will allow you to become a nightingale and use your abilities for whatever you wish. And in return, both in life and in death, you must serve as a guardian of the Twilight Sepulchre. Aye, there's always a catch. But at this point, always a catch. there isn't much to lose. If it means the end Shall of the ask, day, you can count me in. What about you? Count Are you me ready in. to transact the oath with Nocturnal? Yes, I'm ready. Good. Let's do this. Project. Please stand on the Western Circle. Western Circle. Trust the lass and take the deal. 
Yeah, of course. Come on, bring you off. Don't be a pussy. We'll Come on. The oath is complete. All right. Western. I need to go to the west. Go west. Na, na, this na, is na, enough na, to make na. you hate a bit, eh? Yes. We'll speak when the oath is complete. Open it. <laughs> kind of a. We'll speak when the oath is complete. Yeah, I know. I'll repeat it again. Time's wasted. And Mercer's still out there. Let's get this show on the road. Yeah. Let's go. So I'm here. Come on, guys. I don't have all day. <laughs> How are you doing, Ask? Welcome to the stream, man. I call upon you, Lady Nocturnal. Yeah. Queen of Merc and Empress of Shadow. Hear my voice. Ah, Carlia. I was wondering when I'd hear from you again. Lose something, did we? My lady, I've come before you to throw myself upon your mercy and to accept responsibility for my failure. You're already Excellent mine, mask. Carlia. Your terms were struck long ago. Thank what you for, you for passing by. Over me now? Others that wish to transact the oath to serve you both in life and in death. You surprise me, Caroline. This offer is definitely weighted in my favor. My appetite for Mercer's demise exceeds my craving for wealth, Your Grace. Revenge. How interesting. Yeah. Very well. The conditions are acceptable. You may proceed. Cool. Lady Nocturnal, we accept your terms. We dedicate ourselves to you as both your Avengers and your Sentinels. We will honor our agreement in this life and the next until your conditions have been met. Yeah, let's Very go. Well. I name your initiates Nightingale, and I restore your status to the same, Carlisle. Excellent. And in the future, I'd suggest you refrain from disappointing me again. Oh, it's a, it's a tough, tough lady. Speak with Kalaya. Okay, so we are Nightingales now. Okay, Kalaya. Now that you've transacted the oath, it's time to reveal the final piece of the puzzle to you. Okay. Mercer's true crime. See you later, Ask. Thank you for passing by. Go have some, some good, some good lunch or dinner. I guess it's in it, right? <laughs> They're in Norway. Okay. He's done more, Mercer. Mercer was able to unlock the guild's vault without two keys because of what he stole from the Twilight mm. Sepulchre. The skeleton key. By doing this, he's compromised our ties to Nocturnal and, in essence, caused our luck to run dry. Okay. So the key unlocks any door? Well, yes. But the key isn't only restricted to physical barriers. All of us possess untapped abilities, the potential to wield great power securely sealed within our minds. Once you realize the key can access these traits, the potential becomes limitless. Oh, this is nice. Um... <laughs> the three of us could keep it. I'm afraid that's impossible. If the key isn't returned to its lock in the Twilight Sepulchre, Things will never be the same in the guild. Really? As time passed, our luck would diminish to the point of non-existence. And whether you know it or not, our uncanny luck defines our trade. Hmm. First time I ever set out to return something. <laughs> Very true. In our line of work, it's quite rare we set out to return a stolen item to its rightful owner. Yeah. Okay, let's go. Before we depart, Brynjolf has some business to discuss. I suggest you listen to him. All right. Listen, lad. There's one last piece of business we need to settle before we go after Mercer. What? The leadership of the guild. Yeah? What else? Listen, lad. There's one last piece of business we need to settle before we go She's after Mercer. He's going to repeat everything. The leadership of the guild. All right. Why tell this to me? Carlia and I had a long discussion before you arrived here. Thanks to your efforts. Mercer's treachery has been exposed. After we deal with them, 
All that remains is restoring the guild to its full strength. As a result, we both feel as Shring, you have the Shiring 20. Hello, man. As leader of the Thieves Guild. Leader of the Thieves Guild. Yes. Let's just ask for pride here. Me? What about you? I've been at this game a long time, my friend. A long time. I've stolen trinkets from nobles and framed priests for murder. I'm good at what I do. Maybe even one of the best. Mm. That's all I know. All right. I've never been one to lead. Never desired it. Never cared for it. You no are the one. follower type. All right. Um, <laughs> it's about time you ask. Um, I don't know what you say. Let's act humble here. Well, we have a bit of an errand to run before your coronation. So don't get sentimental <laughs> on that. All right. All right. I accept. I'm going to be a humble leader of the Thieves Guild. Then it's decided. Yeah. When this is all over and Delvin's contacts assure me that we've regained our footing in Skyrim, we'll handle the details. Until then, we have quite the task ahead. All right. Let's get it. Let's get to it then. I've Perfect. I've been over the plans you brought us, and I'm convinced the eyes of the Falma are in the Dwarven ruins at Urkenthat. Carlia and I will meet you there. Prepare yourself, lad. This will be a fight to remember. Excellent. So, do you think we stand a chance against Mercer? Of course, we start a chance against Mercer. I already defeat the guy. So, let's just see what he says here. I guess we are Nightingales now. Aye, and some of what Carlyle said is starting to make sense. Mercer may have damaged our reputation and raided our coffers. This goes well beyond even his twisted form of larceny. Old Delvin kept calling it a curse, and we all laughed at him. All Looks right. like the joke's on us. Uh, perfect. Until so, next we meet, lad. until next we meet. All right, this is great. This is really great. Uh, let me see, guys. So, now in terms of the quest, this is one. Let me go there. No, this is another one. Yes, that's the one. I'm on my way to Ekengdan Thunder or something. Uh, ask can <laughs> help me out with the pronunciation here. A vast dwarven ruin that supposedly contains the legendary eyes of the former. Kalai and Brin Chover waiting for me within. Together we hope to stop Mercer Frey from stealing the eyes and escaping from Skyrim with the skeleton key of Nocturnal. So we need to travel there and we are going to we are going to do this right now, guys. Um, let me see if in the in the inventory you have something, uh, something else. I did not receive anything else. I'm carrying a lot, so what what I'm going to do is um, at least for the recorded episode, guys. I'm going to put a pause here. Uh, I'm going back and leave some of the stuff that I have on me. I listen in Sorry, the house. Lass. I've got important things to do. We'll yeah. Time. Move along, bring you. Don't mind me. <laughs> Okay, uh, let's just go to to the house and leave some of the stuff, and uh, we can we can resume the we can resume the mission later on. Let me see what what we have inside. Also, look at this, guys. Be right back. Gonna get some tea. Go grab some tea. Look a bit. Don't worry, man. Here's some. Oh, really? Get up with you. You too. Yeah. Stay there. Don't get up. Uh, I guess this is the place. This is it's all lurking with with bandits all around. They're going to be dead soon though. There you are. Um, one thing that we can do, actually, this this place. Okay, we can come back here with uh, with Lydia and, and get all the stuff from 
that we can carry out like, like we usually do. I'm not going to be getting a lot of things right now, but we know that we can that we can come back here. Let me let me now go inside. It seems this is inside this place. This place looks amazing, guys. Look at this. Potions. This is going to be really good. Coin purse, excellent. And let's do this. Like it. Under armor, gold, potion of minor magica. There we are. This is incredibly good. So, this is the place. Let's see. There might be some. Ooh. There we are. I don't know if that helps in so in, in anything, but let's just do that. All right. There's a chair. More potions. Come on, give me that potion. There we are. Just enjoy the view. <laughs> um, look at this place. Let's just do this for a minute, guys. Look at all the. This game is old, but look at all the detail that, that went into into creating this this level as an old man, an old gamer, should say. This game. This game is why. This is why I come back to this game all the time and never want to end it. Yes, yeah, it's great. Alright. Let's just go. I'm going to put the, the other hood. That was good because I now see that I don't have that hood on me. Uh, the Nightingale hood. I don't know if, if I really need that because of the power it gives you, but just because it's cool. It's really cool to keep all the... You hear something? Yeah. No. We are going home. Burned. Looky here. Looks like we got that. Yeah. And you too. Burn. Burn, baby, burn. Disco inferno. Yeah. So I'm a little fuckatish. I'm back, Lukovic says. Perfect. Welcome back, man. Alright, I'm trying to get in. This old ruin and this place is really amazing. So you can apply for affiliation. Yeah, we were talking about that. We can, I, I can do that, uh, that thing. Ah, you're kind of. Uh, you don't like fire, right? Yeah, I know. Me neither. I'll tell my friend about you to reach your 50 followers. Oh, that will be really, really good. Thank you, Nat. So you can apply for affiliation. That would really, would be really good. Um, but yeah, you, you don't need to, to kind of go and force people. For, I know you are not going to force them, but uh, it will be really nice. But also, it will be also cool that they kind of uh, enjoy the channel too but yeah it will it will be really cool to to have affiliation 50 50 followings kind of of the minimum amount of followers that you need for twitch affiliation so i'll wisp some of friend now we try to hit 50 followers today bro i am <laughs> that would be really awesome i'm going to be dancing all day today if that's the case. Um, all right, let me go there. And it seems we are doing. This is the place to go. It really seems this is the place to go. Um, all right, let's just do this. I really don't know what. 
Look at all the trouble this band is putting to this place. They're kind of making this their own. I don't know if I'm, if I'm going in the correct way here for the mission, but it's kind of cool to, to go over all this. Bob and arrow, leather braces of minor deft hands. Not too many are online, so yeah, no problem, no problem at all, man. Really, uh, you you've done a lot for me today, really a lot. I only seen two days. Yeah, I only seen two days and and weekend. Yes, during the weekends I don't have any uh, a special um, special time. One of the of the of, or Fridays or Saturdays I try to do. Um, one night and then maybe some afternoon but uh, Tuesdays and Thursdays I can, are kind of uh, or fixes there at, at, at that time I mean UTC minus uh, three it's all there in the in the channel info so we arrived guys we need to speak to Kalaya now 